what is going on youtube it's your favorite shoe tuber me and my kicks coming at you with another detailed review and on foot of the adidas ultra boost 1.0 texas a m aggie edition man coming up <music> Getting into the details of the shoe, the shoe comprises of an all prime knit 1.0 upper. As you can see, it got that uh, 1.0 design right here. The best um, prime knit design, in my opinion, as far as laces, they give you maroon, maroon laces, maroon tips. And you know, the cajun is plastic and the stripes are white. And the midsole is like a burgundy. It's like a little darker burgundy than this upper. And on the back of the shoe, you got um, Ultra Boost painted in gold. and on the medial side of the shoe is exactly like the lateral side of the shoe the best part of the shoe and like what they really switch it up in my opinion is this um tongue area is felt and as far as like the logo right here this is the patch and it's you know got the hand signal it says giggle on the right shoe and on the left shoe you got the texas a and you know logo and if you don't want to rep school spirit they also give you some adidas um, patches you know maroon with the gold on there so that's nice so you can switch it up but if you don't want to rock anything you can just tear it off so that's the best aspect of the shoe you can show school pride you can show adidas pride or you can show no pride at all and as far as the insole of the shoe goes the insole is all white and it says giggum in maroon and i really don't like this white outsole because two or three wears this is definitely gonna you know not look the same but you know it is what it is i wish they would like kind of made this gold or just kept it maroon as far as sizing goes with the shoe i would suggest going a half size up to an entire size up if you have a fat or a wide foot if you have a narrow to a normal foot you can definitely go true to size in these shoes these shoes retail at 180 dollars and how i came across my pair was when I first heard about the NCAA 1.0 Adidas pack, I was definitely intrigued. I like any Ultra Boost that got that 1.0 prime knit pattern. And then the fact that they was like, you know, representing, you know, certain schools and had them in different colors. I was intrigued with that as well. I got um, six pairs out of the eight, and I also did a whole unboxing video. I'll put it up above if you want to check it out, but definitely a great video. But anyways, you know, I hit up Sonika Sneakers. It's a store located in Ohio. Um, that was the only store that I know that was getting these shoes in the Adidas store as well. I want to say more than likely this is on the Texas A&M like bookstore website. So, you know, just double check that if you want them. But, you know, I went on there, hit up um, Sonika, asked them, can I get these shoes? You know, they gave them to me no problem. They shipped it to me next day. So I got these shoes, I want to say a day early. And, you know, I didn't pay any tax. I didn't pay any shipping. So I got these for $180 flat. As far as like the, the resale and the hype on these shoes, I think that, you know, it's not going to be too much hype because Boost is dead and hype is not really on Adidas right now. But, you know, I already know if anyone goes to Texas A&M, if you're a student, if you're an alumni, you definitely got to get a pair of these shoes because once again, you know, it has your you know it has everything that you want on them it has you know the aggies sign they got texas a and m so i already know these gonna go hard so you know i suggest you get these sooner than later because eventually later on down the line these will go up in price for a person that really likes you know texas a and m also if you're older you know texas a and m alumni and you want to go back to the school and just you know look at the school you know go to a basketball game football game i would highly suggest that you get a pair of these shoes because since they have ultra boost technology it's some of the most comfortable technology that i've ever heard of i don't know if comfortable list is a word but we're gonna go with it but anyways you know it's like walking on a cloud and you can walk long distances and your feet don't hurt your joints don't hurt so i would definitely suggest that you know if you're in the market of getting like a you know stylish sporty shoe and you want to represent your school at the same time i would highly suggest that you get a pair of these shoes because you really won't regret it you know trust me when i say this but you know i'm just glad that i was able to get this shoe in my collection for retail and even though i never attended texas a m university i can definitely appreciate the craftsmanship in this shoe now without further ado here's an awful look of the adidas ultra boost 1.0 texas a m aggie edition Bitch, 
I'm so cold, yeah, I'm so December Chasing this chatter, chasing this chatter She gon' take drugs with me if I let her As always, I want to thank you guys for watching this video today. I really do appreciate it. Smash that like button if you like this video. Also, comment down below what's your favorite colorway in the Adidas Ultra Boost NCAA 1.0 pack. It could be these, it could be the Sun Devil Edition, the Jayhawk Edition, whatever, man. Just comment that down below and we could chop it up in the comment section. Also, if you aren't subscribed to the channel, what are you doing, man? Hit that subscribe button. It takes nothing but a couple seconds and you'll be notified of when I drop future videos. And lastly, peace.